That makes three disappearances this month in Hurricane, and the police still have zero leads. If you or anyone you know have information regarding this matter, please contact your local police department. Thank you. Do you want to go to a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike? A place where fantasy and fun come to life? Then come on down to Foxy's Family Diner. We have state-of-the-art arcade machines, gourmet pizza, and the best animatronics money can buy. Over at Foxy's, family comes first. What the hell? What do you mean there's nothing you can do? You guys cut my ad slot short! Apologies, sir. Someone paid more for the slot and insisted that it aired at that time. That is ridiculous! I took out a loan to be able to afford that time slot! Sorry, kid. There's nothing we can do. You can always buy another time slot. What?! That was my whole advertising budget! How are you gonna make this right?! Sorry, sir. This line is for paying advertisers only. Paying advertisers? Are you... The nerve! Hey, is everything alright? No! I invested so much into this pizzeria and now it's gonna flop! What am I gonna do? Oh, honey, I'm so sorry. This is terrible. I'm such a failure. Hey, none of that. You are not a failure. You are a wonderful husband and a talented inventor. Who needs expensive advertising? Your pizza is, is going to be the talk of the town. Don't underestimate word of mouth. Go out there and knock them dead. You always know what to say. <laughs> Hey kid, beat it! No one is allowed here! I need to speak to the owner. You got a meeting? No, I just... You just what? His commercial? Ah, I see. You're a fan. Listen kid, I hear you, but I can't let you in. You're gonna have to wait till opening day just like everyone else. First of all, I'm not a fan. Second, I'm not a kid. I'm 19. Ah, so you're old enough to get a real whooping. I didn't come here to fight. We'll either put him up or get out of here, cause you sure as hell ain't getting in. <sighs> Guess I gotta fight this guy. Don't underestimate word of mouth. That's it! What are you talking about, kid? Uh, nothing. I gotta go. Hey, what's with that guy? I don't know, I think he's loony or something. So, Dave, is it? Yes. So why do you want to work for Fred Bear's Family Diner? Well, I'd love to be able to save up to start my life. And what would that look like to you? Well, I'd like to go to college or even work my way up to a manager position. Okay. Do you have any experience working in a pizzeria? Uh, no. My experience is mostly in asset acquisition and sales. What? I worked for a friend's small business. So if I hired you, when could you start? Right away, sir. Alright, Dave. I've got your first assignment. What is it? Is it cleaning the dining room? Maybe making pizza? 
You're gonna be handing out flyers! Hey, Fredbear's Family Diner opens soon. Grand opening! Pizza! Games and state-of-the-art animatronic shows. Fun for the whole family? You like food? Yes, mother. Did you get the job? Yes. Good. You can finally start saving up money to move the hell out of here. That's the goal, you old bat. What did you just say? I said I can't wait to stop freeloading off of you, mother. Oh, I know. I can finally have the house to myself and have all my girlfriends over without you around. It's gonna be so lovely. You know, your father, God bless his soul, he used to talk about kicking you out at 18, but I'm such a great... Hey, and while you're down there, answer the phone. It's interrupting my show. Hello? Hey, Dave. What do you want? Look, man, I don't like where we left things. You mean when you set me up and almost got me arrested? Look, man, I had to get the heat off of me. I've got this new business opportunity, though, that you're gonna love. It's completely legitimate. For the most part. Dave? Go to hell. William, you can do this. Just, just, just think. Just think for a second. What do we have to do? We have to get uh, so much stuff fixed at the diner, and, and this roof is leaking too, and it's fine. Just, just one thing at a time. We'll fix the roof in here, but I can't even get the roof fixed. I can't afford any of this. What am I- Ah! Oh. Hun. Oh. Hun. What? Hun. What? Hun. Calm down. It... You're doing a wonderful job. What? Apparently not. Look at the roof. Look at the state of all this. I think- it, Did it's... I- did I make a mistake in buying that diner? It's... I, I don't know if I could pull this off. You're doing a wonderful job. We have a home now. We're newly married. Mm. You're doing good. But No place to go but up. But that commercial too, I spent all that money on it. it we didn't even have that money to spend. I just... I, I assumed it would bring in more customers and things would be fine, but... But Henry's just played right over it and... What if, what if no one comes to the diner? What if it fails? What do we do? We won't be able to pay for the roof over our heads anymore. Honey, honey, breathe. Remember? Breathe. There you go. I'll put up more posters around near the flower shop, and I'm sure we will get you some business soon. Well, but you shouldn't have to do that. I, I should be able to handle this, and... You know what? It's, it's fine. I'll... We'll figure something out, right? Yes. All right. Yes, we will. Well, all right. I'm, I'm going to try to finish up some more work. Uh, what, what are you doing? Um, I was just sitting out on the balcony, admiring oh. your pizzeria. Oh, uh, thanks. I guess. Despite the leaky roof, this is the best view ever. Uh, don't worry. We'll, we'll get this all fixed. I'll get the roof fixed. We'll get some money coming in from the diner when it officially opens. It, and this will all work out. Trust me, this will all be worth it. I believe in you. Thank you. 
All right, let me finish this up and... Oh, there's just so much to do. I don't even know where to start. Come on, come on. Can't this old thing go any faster? Uh, finally, jeez. Come on, open up. I can't believe I stayed in there that long. I was supposed to be in and out. I left Dave at the diner all day. Oh, how could I let it get like this? We're not even open yet, and I'm already dropping the ball? Ah, uh, it's fine, come on. Yes, the bike started! Oh, thank goodness. The one day I actually needed to. There we go, just nice and slow. Ah, uh, you know what, that's fine. Everything's okay. You know what, the diner will work out well. Oh, look, there's posters everywhere. Did, did Dave do that? Uh, the gas station. There's posters there, too? Oh. There's posters all over the place. Okay, I'll just park right here and... Oh, I made it. I made it. Thank goodness. Let me just... What? Why were these doors unlocked? Oh, man. He had one job. What? What is... Oh, come on. Not the phone, too. Hello? Uh, uh, uh Fred Bear's Family Diner. This is William. Thanks for calling. <laughs> you don't have to say all that. It's just me, Andrew. Drew, that's you? How you been? Yeah. I haven't heard from you in so long. I, you know, I've been doing... Well, to be honest with you, Billy, not too great. Billy? Uh, hey, come on, we're not 12 anymore. I go by I'm William sorry. now? William. Thank you. Listen, man, I, I'm in some financial troubles right now, and... I was just, you know, I, I know that you've got that whole pizzeria going on, but... Uh... Uh, your your girlfriend's still working at that flower shop, right? Maybe uh, you could yeah, pa pass me a, a couple no, hundred. No. Andrew, maybe? Andrew, come on! We can't bring her into this. I I just dumped my entire savings on this place. I I have nothing that I could possibly give you. What happened to the come, loan from last time? Come on, man! I I already spent that. I li listen. I I'm in a little bit of debt to some people, and please, I William, you uh, gotta help me. I. Andrew, trust me, I would love to help you, but I physically cannot. I, I don't have any money to spend. If I lose any more money, I lose this place, I lose the apartment, I lose everything. I'm sorry, okay. but I, I think you're on your own for this one. Nah, I get it, I get it. Yeah, never did have time for your little brother, did you? Hey, come on. Right, well, you know it's not hey, like good... that. Mm -hmm. Good luck with that opening day. Yeah, thanks. Good luck to you, too. Oh, jeez, come on. Not today. Oh, it's fine, just, just let it go. Whew, all right, everything's okay. Everything's in order. It's actually nice and clean in here, and... Oh, no, the animatronics! What... What happened? Are they... They're still all broken? Dave! Dave, where are you? Oh, no, no, no! Dave? Are you... No! No! <laughs> Dave, uh, back here? Uh, uh, no, not like this. Dave, are you? <laughs> hey, uh, Dave, oh, what are you doing? Oh, hey, boss. Oh, I, I was just watching The Outsiders. <laughs> oh, no, not Johnny. The Outsiders? <laughs> Dave, what, do you, what have you been doing all day? This, this place is a mess. The animatronics are broken still. Well, well, I don't know how to fix them. It's it's not like there's a manual laying around. Dave, there is a manual. I gave it to you before I left. That was oh. your only job today. Oh, oh, you mean that those pieces of paper? Oh, yeah, I threw those out. Dave, what do you mean you threw them out? We're opening in, in less than a week. We we don't have time I for the animatronics to still be broken. Oh, come on, boss. Like, I, I spent all day putting up flyers and cleaning this place. I did a lot. What? A lot? All I asked you to do was make sure they were up and running. It, we already oh, had a bunch on. of flyers. You, you, you know I'm not good with all that technical stuff. That's that's more your area. Oh, uh, Dave, I have so much going on right now. I don't have time to take care of everything. That's why I hired you. Oh, I'm sorry, boss. Uh, I, I just... Uh, look, I, I'm just kind of scared to work on those things. I, I'm afraid what? of getting electrocuted. Electrocuted? What, scared? Dave, come on. Come over here. Look at these. What, what are you scared oh. of? Look at them. They're old, crappy suits. 
Oh, they're creepy, man. Like, I'm gonna be honest, they're really creepy. Well, this is your job, so you better get over that. You're gonna be working closely uh -huh. with these two every day. I'm sorry, boss. Dave, listen to me. Look at me. I need I'm you looking. to focus, okay? I have too much on the line for anything to go wrong on opening day, okay? All right. I, I, it won't happen again, I promise. All right. Thank you. Well, I guess... I'm gonna go finish my movie. Wait, what? What do you mean, finish your movie? We we got work to do. Oh, come on. I, I, I can't leave... I can't just, like, leave the movie unfinished. Sure you can. Pause it and watch it when you're home. On your own oh. time. Not at All work. Right. Fine, I'll, I'll, I'll get to work on the animatronics. Oh, thank you. Well, that's settled. I guess I can finish up paperwork back here. Or... Oh, man. Just one thing after another in this place. Hey, hey, this this bolt isn't important, right? Wait, what? What bolt? The one on the back of the head. What? Yes, that's important. There are no spare parts. Everything's essential. Just... Oh, every part's essential? Oh, yes. Okay, got it. Oh, jeez. Dave, are you, are you sure you can handle that? Uh, yeah, yeah, I got it, boss. Don't worry. Okay, I, I'm trusting you, Dave. Oh, jeez, I can't look. It's fine, it's fine. You, you, you gotta let other people in charge sometimes, William. That's how things get done. <sighs> okay, I'll grab some more flyers. And you know what? Maybe, maybe this is fine. This, this will all work out. Right? Hey, Dave, how's it coming? Um, yeah, I'm gonna be honest. I don't really know what I'm doing. <sighs> it's fine. It's fine. You know what? Let's just, just take the rest of the day off. Let's come back into it tomorrow fresh, and we'll dig out the manuals out of the trash, okay? Uh, all right. Y you sure, boss? Because yeah, I could stick around if you need me. No, no, it's fine. I, I'll just work a little overtime. I'll, I'll get them up and running. Can I have that wrench? Uh, sure, here you go. Thanks. Here, right, you know what? Well, you take these in. Put them up on your way home. Uh, oh, uh, all right. Thanks, I appreciate it. All right, don't don't overwork yourself, boss. Yeah, yeah, see you later. Uh, all right. boss? What, what, what now? Uh, there's people at the door. Uh, didn't you tell them we're closed? We're not open uh, yet. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go to the office. All right. Hey, listen, we're not open yet. I need you guys to go. There's so much, uh, officers. How's it Mr. going? Mr. Afton. Uh, speaking, how, how can I help? We'd like to have a few words with you. So, uh, yeah, that's basically the gist of it. Uh, there's been some disappearances in the area. We're just going door to door, making sure everybody in the neighborhood is... Feeling safe, secure, and uh, if you see any information, uh, feel free to reach out to your local PD. Oh my god. Children missing in Hurricane? That's... Yeah, it's, uh, you know, three wouldn't be a cause for alarm anywhere else, but you know how it is. I mean, it's a small town. Yeah, three I... people isn't, uh, isn't too good for us. I've never you know? even heard of any crime happening here, let alone something like that. What's... Well, it's out of the ordinary for sure. But if if you if you see anything, or if your family sees anything, please please reach out. Oh my family! Uh, and this is my partner, by the way, uh, Deputy uh, oh. <laughs> Ballzinger. <laughs> oh hey, nice, uh, nice to meet you. Yeah, so uh, he, they're gonna take your questions uh, if you have oh. any. Um, okay. Oh. Okay. Wait a second. What? Do you have anybody else in the building? Uh, well, I mean my employee is in the back office area but he's oh, oh he's... you got an employee in the back office. hey can you maybe uh maybe get their info too thank you thank oh. you okay are they listen. gone oh uh, uh 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 hello officer oh geez oh good <laughs> luck with that deputy <laughs> uh. <laughs> hey uh your, your employee you wouldn't you wouldn't say he's uh He's a little fishy, would ya? What? No, Dave. No, he's. Oh, I mean, okay. lazy yeah, more than anything. Check. But, but no, he's. Tell me the story about this place. It's uh, is it open yet? It's beautiful. Hey, well, thank you. I'm glad. Uh, not open yet. We're doing the finishing touches. We're actually just finishing up repairs on these two, the stars of the show. 
Uh, hey, you have any kids? You want to bring them down on opening day? You know, get some pizza. When you guys open? Oh, we actually, you know what? I think I saw one of the posters on the way in. The fourth, right? Yeah, the fourth. You could, you know, bring family down. Bring your other police buds down. Get some. Well, I don't know about pizza. that, but I do have some some nieces and nephews that might find this place uh, pretty exciting. So I might, you know, I. I Maybe I can reclaim my spot as the favorite uncle. <laughs> yeah, see? That's what I'm talking about. Introduce so them to Fredbear, Spring Bonnie. Are these fully automated or? No, they're only the suits. Uh, the someone's suits? gotta climb inside, usually Ugh. me, and probably Dave too, actually, now that I think about it. But yeah, they're, they're are pretty they, cool. Are they hot? They look kind of sweaty. Yeah, They're that's sweating them. It's uh, it's very demanding in there. It gets very, very hot. Hey, but well, more but it, power to you, man. Yeah, it's worth it though. You know, get to see the smiles on everyone's faces, and they really enjoy these two. They love animatronics, you know. Oh. Well, yeah. I mean, uh, if he, if that's your cup of tea, you know, maybe maybe the nieces and the nephews will like it too. But uh, what about these arcade games? They seem pretty fun. Listen, I'm gonna cut to the cut to the chase, okay? Okay. These disappearances have got people on edge. All right, I, I don't want to make too much small talk. I, I need info, all right? And you seem like a well-connected guy. Please, I'm pleading with you. Anything you see or hear. Of course, of course, officer. I, anything. I mean, I okay. I want this place to be safe too. You know, me and my wife were actually uh, thinking about maybe starting a family here, but. I, I don't I don't know now now that three people have gone missing in such a short amount of time I just I, I don't know is do you think it's connected do you think what if what if they nah, just keep going? It's, it's random it's they're not connected at all oh, listen your local great. PD's got this covered as long as we can get just a little bit of info to get our foot in the door okay of course so keep your eyes peeled you of know your we'll citizens responsibility a citizens mm -hmm. duty uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm gonna go check on my partner. You're welcome oh, to come yeah. with. Yeah, yeah, okay, sure. Okay. Let's go see what's going on back there. Let's take it. Oh, you got his oh. info? Hey there, Dave, was it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, hey, don't sweat too much there, buddy. You're wearing a white shirt. Uh, yeah, no, it's it's uh, it's hot in here, you know? I've been working uh, all night. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is he not working in the back or something? Because it's pretty cool out here. Uh, uh yeah, it's, 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 uh, it's a sauna back there. Uh. Huh. <laughs> okay then. Well, me and the deputy are gonna head out then. But you guys, good luck. Good luck to hey, you both. Thank you. Uh, spread the word. Uh, you can grab some flyers on the way out. You know, pass them around. If, if, yeah, if I'm not gonna want. do that. But I will bring the nieces and the nephews like a uh, week after opening day. You know, it's always oh, crowded the first yeah. day. I don't wanna. Oh yeah, it'll be so. it'll be packed in here with. Yeah, I mean, it always sure. is when a new restaurant opens. You know, yeah. all right, let's go, deputy. <laughs> hey, do you mind if I grab a soda on the way out of the vending oh. machines working? or uh, uh, Go ahead, yeah, help yourself. Right. Whatever you, hey, you want, want to pop two? You want to pop two, deputy? There you go, all just right. to help yourselves. Uh, you know where the door is and everything. Dave, get in, get in the office. Get it, get in there. Hey, what, what's wrong with you? Oh, oh man, I, I'm sorry. I, I should have told you. Told me what? Dave, what's going on? Okay, look, man, I, back in the day, I, I used to burgle houses with my friends. Wait, what? I, I didn't think it would catch up with me. What? Dave, no, they, they weren't here because of that. They were here for missing children. Oh, oh, well, yeah, I don't know anything about missing kids, oh, but, Dave, yeah. you scared me. I thought you were going to say you had something to do with it. You gave me a heart attack. I, I almost had a hitch oh, sorry, in the head with boss. this wrench. Uh, don't please don't hit me. No, no, I, I wouldn't. But you gotta calm down. You must made them arrest you just now. I, I know. I, I thought they were here to arrest me. No, listen. You were, you were young. You were dumb. So it, it doesn't matter. None of that's real anymore. Okay. So just, oh, just okay. next time they come in, if more cops come in, just be cool. You don't know nothing. You haven't seen nothing. Everything's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Be cool. Yeah. Hey, listen, I, I'm going to head out. I, my, my mom's going to throw a fit if I'm home late. Oh, your mom again, huh? Well, yeah. All right. I wouldn't want to have her call in here. So go ahead. <laughs> I'll close yeah. up. All right. Uh, you have a good night, William. Yeah, you too. I'll see you tomorrow, Dave. And let's see if I carry the one here. Maybe we can have enough for the rest of the month. And oh, wait a second. What's the time? How long have I been in here for? 
Oh no! Clara's gonna kill me! I gotta get home! I'm gonna be late! I can't be late for this dinner, I promised her! Not again! This house sucks. I, I hate it here. Oh, man, I always have to do everything around here. Oh, man, maybe that's just enough money to maybe get out of here for a few days. Hey, Dave. Dave, did I hear you come in? Dave, are you down there? Uh, yes, mother. Hey, listen. I've got a little cash in, in the fruit basket. Could you take it to the gas station and buy me some smokes? Uh, I, I just came back from there. Hey, be a deer and take the cash and go buy me some smokes. Or do you want to sleep outside tonight? No, Mother. I'll go get you those smokes. That's what I thought. Oh, man. Always doing what she wants. This sucks. Uh, hey, and and while you're, while you're down there, could you answer that phone? Yes, mother. Uh, hello? Hey, uh, Dave? Uh, yeah, yeah, what's up? Listen, we need to talk. You should drop by my house sometime. I've got an offer for you. Who is it, Dave? I know you don't have any friends. Mother, it's for me. Huh, so, sorry about that. My, my mom wanted to know who it was. Anyway, um... Yeah, I'm, I'm sure we can meet up and talk soon, but, um, yeah, none of that funny business, you know? Yeah, no funny business this time. Just come by this weekend. All right, all right. Um, I, I gotta go do some stuff. Okay, have a good one, Dave. Uh, you too. Oh, man, I hate it here, hate it here, I hate it here. Ah, oh, finally home. Honey, I'm home! Oh, what are you doing here? Oh, brother! William, how you uh, doing? Will you're going by William now, right? Yeah, <sighs> I wasn't William. expecting you, Andy. What you doing you're here? finally home. Thank God. Oh, yeah, you know, Clara's just been keeping me company. I've been uh, checking out the old apartment. You know, you got some maintenance you need to keep up with, buddy. Listen, oh, you wow. got a squeaky hinge on this door over here. Look at this. You hear that? You hear yeah, that squeak? pretty squeaky. Yep. <laughs> and, and your light switch. You hear this flick? It's not supposed to be like that. It's not supposed <laughs> to flick. So you got some electrical wiring problems as well. What? Andy, so. Andy, wait, wait a second. Just one second, okay? You what? and me were on the phone earlier today, were we not? Yeah, oh, uh, yeah, I, I just came over because I wanted to apologize about that. You know, I, you've you've always been a, a good brother. And... Oh, well, thank you, thank you. I We appreciate it, but we, we have a, a, a family dinner tonight, so if you could uh, just... Yeah, yeah no, I, I actually was going to stay. Uh, so anyway... <sighs> Check Your this what? out. I, what? Oh, well, it just smelled so good, and you were cooking while I was here, so I assumed you were inviting me over, right? <laughs> well, I mean, we could... There's probably enough for a third plate, right? Oh, fantastic, because I got to tell you something, bro. Check okay. it out. I What's got up? a brand new job. Wait, what? A new yep, job? That's why but... I wanted to come over and apologize. Because, listen, I, I've taken advantage of you a few, a few times over the years, and... I just feel kind of bad. How did you get a new job that fast? You were just asking me for money, like, earlier, today. Well, the funniest thing happened. There's a, a new, well, you know what? It doesn't matter what the job is, but it's a really good one. Trust me, I even got a signing bonus. 
Huh. Used it to buy a new car. New car? Wait, was that your car out there? The yellow one? Yep, that's me. Huh. Just just today, but... Alright, whatever. That, that's great. I'm really happy for you. I'm glad. About Thanks, time. buddy. Yeah, <sighs> getting paid so much. I'm gonna have so much extra cash sloshing oh. around. Feels pretty good. Yeah, that <sighs> is. That's pretty amazing. You, you, so, do you guys just eat at this couch or something? You don't have a dinner table? Well, no, I mean, we don't have a dinner table. We have this nice two person fold up table. Yeah, well, I guess we can't all be so fortunate. <laughs> uh, that's okay. I, I, can, I can eat standing up, of course. You know, family time's what's most important. Oh. I'll just stand right here in front of the TV. Yeah, right in front of the TV. That, that's fine. <laughs> right? Well, that's fine. It's can, fine. Can I, can, I, can I have a word with you? Sure. Oh, hey. no worries. I'm going to check out your, your balcony. I oh, mean, there's got to be at least one good thing about this place, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, how, how long has he been here? Like, an hour and a half now. Oh, I'm so sorry, I didn't know. He called me, but he didn't say he was coming over. What, uh, what should we do? Get rid of him, please. Oh, I had something important to tell you, and I'd like him not to be here. Well, he, he's stubborn, so maybe we just feed him, and then we, we, we get him out. We, we say, oh, we're so tired, it's time for bed, and then he'll leave. But I don't think he'll leave until he eats. He's got to <sighs> he's got to rub it in my face a little bit that he has a new job. So just let so, him and then he'll go. So I have some microwave fish sticks. Would oh those boy. work for him and then we can have our actual dinner after he leaves? Absolutely. Sounds great. Okay. Hey Andy, come on in. Hey. Oh. Hey, come <laughs> Sorry, on. Sorry, you know <laughs> You've actually got a, a broken board out here on your balcony. You should talk to your management about that. Oh, thanks. I'll make yeah, sure I let him hurt. know. <laughs> well, yeah, well, I appreciate it. Yeah, don't forget about the leak, too. It's getting your floor all wet. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a really a nuisance, but, you know, you get what you pay for, right? <laughs> oh, look, we made your dinner. It's right over there. Oh. Enjoy. Wait, is this... <gasps> Fish sticks, my favorite? Come See? on, Billy, you didn't have to make fish sticks. It's William now, and don't worry. Oh, we, sorry. Oh, Lord. <laughs> we just know you so well. <laughs> oh, wow, these are delicious. See? Uh, well, compliments to the chef, right? <laughs> yeah, cool. of course. Thank That's you. So great. Hey, you said you got a new job. You didn't tell me where yet, though. Oh, yeah, I mean, it's it's really not that important. It's not like it's a competitor of yours or anything opening up in the... Huh. Are you sure? Uh, about anyway, that? what? Huh? Mm, you're acting a little I weird. I actually should leave. Uh, it's getting real late out. You know, what? look, all oh, the the moon's already out. It's so it's. Wow, I've overstayed my welcome for sure, guys. So I'll just be uh. What? I'll be heading out. Oh. If you want, you can take your food and go. Oh yeah, absolutely. Oh uh, yeah, there you go. Take it on the road. Uh, uh, well, don't forget to get all those things fixed, you know, oh, squeaky door, uh, leaky roof, uh, yeah. uh, broken plank. I'll see you guys later. For Bye. Sure. See you later. <laughs> I can't <gasps> believe this. He was, he was just on the phone begging me earlier for money. Now he just has a job and a brand new car and his life's turned around in under a day. That's that, not fair. No, that's definitely not fair. <sighs> You've worked so hard and you're, you're going to get there someday. It's fine. Let's just enjoy our dinner and it just... He's gone. He's gone. Everything's fine. It's okay. Yeah. Oh, hey. What was the thing you had to tell me, by the way? Oh, um... Come on, Clara. Spit it out. I've been waiting all day. I'm pregnant. <laughs> William. Uh, it was five, five more minutes. William. Mm, what? What's up? Is breakfast it's... ready? <sighs> yes, it is. Time to get up. Oh, great. All right. Uh, uh, oh, jeez. I didn't sleep too good. What, what time is it? Um, 11 a.m. 
11 a.m.? Claire, what do you mean 11 a.m.? I, I gotta go! Why'd you let me sleep this late? Because you didn't sleep at all last night. But, but that doesn't matter. I need to get back to the diner. I need... There's so much to do before opening and I slept in again! Oh, honey, no, I gotta, honey, I gotta, breathe. Uh, breathe. <sighs> breathe. You're right. It's going to be okay. You needed your rest, so I let you sleep in a little. You're right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to freak out. Just all this stress just piling up one after another, and it's just... It, it, it's weighing on me a little bit. But you're right. I I'm understand. Sorry. Would you like some scrambled eggs to go? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta eat them on the road, though. I gotta get there quick. Dave's probably already waiting there for me. I, I gotta go. Have a good day at work. I'll see you later. Bye. Oh. Hey, Dave! Dave, sorry I'm late. I just, I, I overslept and a lot's been going on. Dave? Dave? Are you back here watching TV again? Dave, I told you! Wait. Dave? Where are you? You in the bathroom? Dave, you better not have fallen asleep in here again. Dave? He's not in the bathroom either. Oh, he must be working on the animatronics early. Getting a head start, I see. Dave? He's not here. He's not here. It's this late, and he's still not here? That's it. That's it, Dave. I've had it. I've had enough of this. That's it. What's his number again? Uh, here we go. Dave, you better pick up this phone. You better be in an accident or worse. If you're not here on time... Ooh. He didn't answer. He didn't answer my call. He... You ignored my call? That's it. Oh, when you answer this phone, Dave, you are... You are out of here. You are... You're gone. Hello? Hello? Dave? What? Who is this? Stop calling here. Dave's not home. Wait, what? Hello? I said stop calling. What, where is he? He's supposed to be at work. Hello? They hung up on me. You... Oh, Dave, you better never walk through these doors again. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. I, I'll just do it myself. Whatever. Who needs them? <laughs> what a great meeting. Looks like things are finally looking up for old Andy Afton. <sighs> oh, hey. Admiring the new ride? Oh, yeah. It's really nice. Yeah, just got it. It's a four-cylinder... 3.8 liter beauty, isn't it? Oh my gosh. Oh man, this must have been expensive. Yeah, well, you know, some people, we uh, we just like to get the finer things in life, you know? Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> I know all about that. Yeah, well, uh, oh, you walk in here? Uh, uh yeah, I don't, I don't live that far, so, you know, I just decided <laughs> to not use up uh, gas. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I'm sure it was a decision you made. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> well, it was great to meet you. Hey, man, my name's Andy, and don't worry. You'll get there someday. Uh, my my name's Dave, and uh, yeah, yeah, sure. All right, uh, buddy. Well, it was fantastic <laughs> to meet you. I'll see you yeah. later. <laughs> hey, guys. Uh, you guys can't be here. You either need to get inside or get out. Oh, fine. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm here to speak to someone, actually. Oh, Okay. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll see you. I'll see you later, man. Yeah, <laughs> what was your name you again? Oh, uh, Andy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I I'll remember that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, losers. Oh, if, if William knows where I've been, he's gonna be so upset. Oh, you know, it it's it's all right, Dave. It's all right. He he's not gonna be that man. He he's a good man. He's a good man. He won't he won't be too upset with you. Oh, okay, here it goes. Hey, William. Nope. I'm here. Nope. Just get out. What? Get what? out. Aw, oh, come on, man. You, you can't be that upset. Can't be that upset? Dave, look at this place. Yeah, it looks you great. Were you were supposed to be here. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm sorry. I had other things to do, and I, I couldn't get a hold of you. Other things to do? This is your thing to do. We open tomorrow, and you weren't here. Look how late it is. Why'd you even show up? 
Well, well like, I just, I wanted to show up in case there was anything else I needed to do. Uh, you know I'm not anything really good else? with working the animatronics. I gave you a manual! All you had to do was read it! Uh, you know that manual is super confusing? Confusing? Dave, this, we're opening tomorrow! Opening day? But don't worry, don't worry. I got the suits working. They're ready for opening. It's fine. I could do it without your help. Wait, without my help? What, Look at that. William. They're as good as new. Yeah, Perfect. I mean, Pristine yeah, they, even. they look great. Um, but, like, yeah, the entire thanks. place looks looks nice, though. Like, there wasn't really much to do here anyway. Well, yeah, whatever, I guess. But you still should have called or let me know. It's been hours. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, boss. It, it won't happen again. I just, I really had some other things to do. <sighs> whatever. It's fine. I mean, you know what? I wanted to apologize as well. I... I know I've been really hard on you lately. It's just the stress of this place, you know? Opening it up from scratch and just trying to make it as good as it can be. That I'm sorry, Dave. I got a little too heated. It's all right. What's what's going on with you, man? You you've been like super stressed lately. Uh, well, uh Clara let me know that she's having a baby. Oh my gosh, dude. That's that's awesome. Congratulations. Uh, yeah, but we have a studio apartment, and I barely have this business up and running yet, so what? what's even going to happen? Is Are we going to be able to have it? Can we even afford it? And it's just uh, it's just too much right now. I just I need to focus on this one thing at a time. Hey, hey, man. Look, like this place is looking great. When we open up, you know, word of mouth is going to go around, and we're, we're going to be filled with customers, and you'll be able to take care of your child, no problem. And, you know... Worst case scenario, you know, there's always adoption, you know? Yeah, great. That makes me feel a lot better. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm glad, I'm glad. Yeah. Well, hey, while you're here, I mean, there's a few more things we could finish up yeah. before opening. So, let's just, let's get on that and let's get ready for tomorrow morning. It's gonna be a huge day. I hope you're ready. Sure thing, boss. Great. I'm gonna go sit in the office for a second. Alright, I'm gonna go clean up the back. So why'd you do it? I swear it wasn't me. You were acting very suspicious. You mind explaining that? I was worried about the kid? Worried that someone might find her. Worried that no one would. And why should I believe you? Because it's the truth! Oh yeah? Where's your employee? Dave Miller. What do you mean? You can't find him? He disappeared before we could arrive. You know anything about that? No, I... You're lying to me! I swear I'm telling the truth! That's enough, Johnson. I'll take it from here. But... Leave us. Okay, let's start this over again. Please, I've already told you guys everything. I know, and you're gonna do it again until I believe you. Fine. I'll tell you what happened again. Okay, Dave, I'm counting on you. You're gonna be in charge of making pizzas, and I'll do all the greeting, seating, and feeding. You're gonna feed them? Yeah, why? I think they could feed themselves. Huh? What are you... It's not like they're baby birds or something. Surely they could chew without assistance. Ew, gross. I'm not going to chew their food for them. I'm going to deliver it to them. Then why didn't you just say that? Because I... It rhymed, okay? Look, I just need you to make the pizzas. Can you handle that? Got it, boss. Welcome to Fred Bear's Family Diner. Would you like a table or a booth? A uh, booth. Okay, right this way. Mommy, can I go play with the bear and bunny? Are those things playful? Unfortunately not. Those are just for shows. Come back in a month or so and they'll be able to play and interact. Aww, I want to play with a bunny. 
I got an idea. Wait here. Are you sure about this, boss? Not even a little, but I can't disappoint the kids. Didn't you say these suits are dangerous if worn by a person? A little. How much is a little? The spring locks aren't that dangerous. They're not even done yet, so the odds of them locking up is very low. Maybe you should wait before you start wearing these. Dave, it's for the kids. And for my own kids. Dave, you're in charge of the dining room. Hey, kids, it's Spring Body! Wait, what does any of this have to do with the missing child? I was getting to that. Look, man, I don't need cutesy rabbit suit stories. I tried being good cop, but it seems like you just want to waste my time. I don't want all the backstory. I want to know where the missing child is. Oh, well, if you just had let me finish my story, you'd have a better understanding. Fine. Finish your damn story. Okay. Where was I? Oh, boy, it's getting pretty hot in this suit. I really need to be careful not to sweat too much. So you expect me to believe that you were trapped in the suit and that's why the child ran? It's the truth! Seriously? Okay, Mr. Apton, you're free to go. What? Why? We've arrested your employee, Dave Miller, for kidnapping. Are you serious? Yes, now move along. I want to speak to my lawyer. You work in a pizzeria. You can't afford a lawyer. Well, I have rights. You have the right to remain silent. I suggest you use it. So, Dave, is this your thing now? First it was burglary, and now it's kidnapping children? I didn't kidnap her, I swear. You were caught with the child down the street from the pizzeria. Let me explain, please. Ah, uh, what the hell? I've got a few minutes. Okay, it all started this morning when Fred Rare's family diner had its grand opening. Okay, Dave, I'm counting on you. You're gonna be in charge of making pizzas, and I'll- We already heard that part. Can we skip ahead, you know, to the point? Oh. Uh, okay. Hey, kid. Please don't hurt me! What? I, I don't want to hurt you. Why are you out here? That scary rabbit was going to hurt us. Oh, you mean my boss? You work for a rabbit? <laughs> no, it's just a suit. Then why is it bleeding? Because my boss is an idiot. Then why do you work for him? Listen, kid. One day you're gonna work a job you don't like. For how long? Probably until you die. What? I mean, uh, until you graduate college and you do what you want to do with your life. Oh, okay. Huh? With your life, you're working a job you don't like, so what are you planning to do after? I don't really know, kid. Oh. But, but that's okay. Not everyone knows what they want. I want to be just like you. Why? Because most grown-ups just ignore me. 
like my parents. He saw me running away and followed me just to make sure I was okay. They're a really nice person. You, you really think that? Yes! What's your name? It's Vanessa. Nice to meet you, Vanessa. I'm Dave. Hey, we should really get you back to your parents. Ah, shit. So, let me get this straight. You saw this little girl running away, and just like that, you were no longer the criminal we knew you to be? I don't care if you don't believe me. You might care what the judge has to say. Hey, I just talked to the little girl. And? As much as I hate to say it, Mr. Miller here didn't kidnap her. She ran off and he was helping her back to the diner. Wipe that smirk off your face. We'll find something to put you away for sooner or later. Am I free to go? Get out of my sight before I arrest you for loitering. Have a good night, officers. <laughs> Ah, thank you. Have have a great night. Thanks. Uh, thanks for being ah, yeah, so you too. kind. You too, buddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, a, absolutely. Have a good one. <laughs> <sighs> Dave. Dave. Huh? What the hell what? was that? What did you do? I, I didn't do anything. What do you mean you didn't do anything? They brought you in here in handcuffs, Dave. That doesn't oh. mean you didn't do anything. Hey, look, I, I know how it looks, but, like, I, I found the missing child, and I... Look, man, I, I know how it looks and, and everything, what? but... And what? You found the uh, well, missing child, then you should have brought them in immediately. Where's the issue? He, she was scared and I needed to comfort her, okay? And she was what? scared because of you. What? You had to comfort him? Why you? Why not anyone else? Because I was the only one who saw her run off. Oh, damn, Dave. Now look, what am I supposed to do here? You've been arrested twice? What? Two times this wasn't now. Even, this wasn't even my fault. I was trying to do a good thing, William. You tried to do a good thing? Then bring the kid home. Bring him to his parents. Bring him to me and we can call the police or something. Well, Don't I can't just... just grab a child and force him to go somewhere. That's kidnapping. Oh, Dave. God. This... I don't... I don't think... I think you have to go, Dave. I think this Wait. is it. I, I can't have someone like this working for me. Wait, Not what now. do you need someone like this? Like, I've been trying to be a better person. Like, how could you say something like that? And that's great. Continue trying to be a better person somewhere else. I can't have someone like you working under my company. The, the grand you know opening already went poorly, and now all of this on top of it. Just go go somewhere else, Dave. You know, the grand opening went bad because you tried to put on that suit that you knew you weren't supposed to put on. Well, maybe if you got work on the suit sooner, maybe I wouldn't have had to do it last minute. Huh? Yeah, sure. Bl just blame me. Blame everyone but yourself, William. Because you know it is I don't you. Wanna work I don't want to work for you. I quit. Good. You're fired anyway. You don't quit. I fire you. Whatever. Uh, come on. Great. Now, oh, uh, hello, hey, uh, officer. I, I don't mean to uh, butt in on your business, uh, Mr. Afton. You know, see, listen, because, uh, you know, you seem like a nice guy. Oh, thank but... you. I just, uh... Just a disagreement with my former employee. No, nothing oh, going on. <laughs> former, yeah, that makes sense. That's yeah. probably a good decision there, Will. Probably yeah. a good decision. It's fine. I could, I'll replace him in a second. Who needs him anyway, right? Yeah, exactly. That's that's the spirit right yeah. there. That's the spirit. You'll replace him. You'll find somebody better that'll do the job better. You know, that's, exactly. that's it. You know, and you'll pay him less too. <laughs> exactly. See, you get it. Uh, hey, yeah, you're not, that's, that's you're not looking for a job, are you? No man, I, ah, I, no, I, just, I get I get government benefits here, buddy. Ah, I, was, I was kidding. No, I was just kidding. I have plenty of people lined up. Don't worry. <laughs> uh, well, uh, good luck with that. Hey, you know what? I, my my nephew, he's looking for a job. Uh, he's yeah? a really responsible kid. I'll send him your way. When are you doing uh, interviews? Uh, well, I feel like probably not tonight. You know what? Send him by That's in fair. a couple days. Let me uh Will get do. this arm to rest. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, you you take it easy, okay? You're going to be able to drive home with that arm? Yeah, it should be fine. Don't worry about it. I'll make sure I go under the speed limit. Don't worry. <laughs> oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. Well, hey, you drive safe out there, Will. You oh, thank safe. you. I will. Hey, I'm bringing the kids by to the uh, 
to the what is it called? Fre Fred Bear's Family Diner oh. that she just opened. I'm bringing the kids by this weekend. Oh, so I'll this, see you there this weekend. <laughs> yeah, that's great. It'll be, it'll it'll be there, tip you know, top no shape. Don't worry. Just no about more it. Uh, whatever happened to your ROM there. I hope that wasn't at the at the job site. No, but as no, long as no. that Dave guy's not working there anymore, I feel totally safe. Oh, my good. Kids. Yeah, don't worry about the arm. That was a, a, fr a freak accident at home. Yeah, nothing to oh. do with the animatronics. <laughs> well, I, I hope it mends well. You have a oh, great night, Dave. You too. I'll I'll see Wait, you later. Uh, Will, Will, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean huh? to call you by your deadbeat employee's name. <laughs> oh, it's, uh, it's fine. Out there. Yeah, yeah. See you later. Oh, great. How am I supposed to drive home like this? This arm hurts so bad. <sighs> it's fine. I'll figure it out. God, I can't believe that, Dave. Just running around and getting in trouble and ruining my business, and now, now look, now I have to find a whole new employee because of him. Great. Well, where do I start? Where do I start? Uh, oh, the Spring Bonnie suit. I forgot about it. Look at this thing. Is this even gonna come out? I gotta be able to get the blood out before all the people come in tomorrow. I can't afford to close down another day. Oh man, Dave, this is his fault. If only he did this work sooner, I wouldn't have had to do it last minute. It, oh, maybe I was a little hard on him. But, but come on, what was he doing? He had to have known how bad that had to look. But, what? Oh, great, who's at the door now? Sorry, we're closed. We're closed for the evening. Please go home. We'll be opening again tomorrow at about, oh! Andy, what? even for me, you're closed. Come oh. on, man. Oh, well, come on in. I sorry, oh. I didn't expect Thanks, you. What, what are you doing here? Oh, are you kidding me? I wanted to see how your opening day went. The grand opening. I'm sorry I oh. couldn't be here. Oh, well, I had work all day, but I saw the signs. I was rooting for you the whole time. Oh, well, thanks, Andy. That really means a lot. But oh, of course, this place uh, looks incredible. Hey, wow, and you really cleaned up nicely. Yeah, I've been finishing up cleaning up now. Uh, just gotta get the chairs back together, then we should be good for another day. Ugh. Hey, man, oh. you got some pizza sauce on this uh, animatronic arm. Uh, yeah, that might you not... You got some on your arm, too, man. Yeah, it might not exactly be pizza sauce. <laughs> Wait, it's the same arm. Well, yeah... Willie, are you okay? Uh, I'm good. I'm fine. I'm fine. We just had a, a small hiccup during opening oh. day. Nothing crazy, nothing too bad. <laughs> uh, was it like an exposed part or something? Uh, yeah, I got a, I, I knew I shouldn't have put the suit on, but the kids really wanted to see it, and and I, I couldn't resist, you know? I hey, I had to. It's not a standalone animatronic. You have to get inside of it? That's how you hurt yourself? Well, yeah. It, <laughs> plus, it's a really old suit, too. It could really go for so some upgrades. Gross. Hey, these kind of look like the suits that you made, uh... Never mind. Hey, what? so, uh, William. Yeah. yeah. I was just wondering, now that we're, uh... Now that we're both adults, we can talk about this, right? Uh, <laughs> sure. We'll talk about what? So, so listen, I, yeah. I got a new job, and... Oh, uh, that's great. I'm happy for it. That helped you pay for that new yellow car, right? Yeah, yeah, no, I'm, um, it's pretty good. I'm an assistant manager, so hey, I make good money now. Congrats, it's I'm proud of you. Fantastic. About time you got your stuff together. <laughs> uh, what does that mean? Oh, like nothing, I just, no, I was just kidding. It was a joke. You know, a instead of bumming money off of me all the time, you know, now you can fend for yourself out there. You're finally growing up, Andy. I'm proud of you. Yeah, I guess. Uh, <laughs> well, joke's on you. What? This, this... I mean, this mess? Frankly, this this would never happen at Foxy's Family Diner. Uh, wait, what do you mean? Oh yeah, uh, Foxy's Family Pizzeria, your one competitor in Hurricane? Yeah. I'm the assistant manager there. You're, <laughs> you're what? Uh, yeah, maybe uh, maybe it's time you got your stuff together, William. You Andy, what's wrong that? with you? Why, why would you work for them? What, they offered me a lot of money. Okay, and the owner off. is a really cool guy. He's they... always talking so slow and smooth. What? Who cares how he talks? They they robbed me. They ripped me off of my ad time. It's on, probably their fault I'm like this. 
It's just business, William. Come on, man. You should business. know that better than anyone. This isn't just business. This is my life. And they went underneath, and they ripped it out from under me. It's their fault this is happening. Uh, whatever. Well, good luck with this little, uh, what'd you call it? A you gotta diner? quit. You gotta quit. Wait, what? Quit? You I'm gotta not quit. Quitting. How would I mean pay you're not for my quitting? Car? They're my competitor. You're you're helping the enemy here. Yeah, and I'm doing a really good job of it, seeing as how this uh, opening day turned out so poorly. Huh. You know what? Fine. Get out. Leave. Come on, I William, never want to see you again. Like I'm so Get out. Never. William. Go. Wait, are you serious? Get out of my diner. I don't need William, you. We're still brother. You I know don't what? need Fine. Dave. I don't need anyone. Get out. I don't need you either. Fine. I, I didn't even want to. I actually came here to brag. I make Good. more money than you. Bye, Good. William. What else is new? Can't wait till you'll be back in a week begging for more anyway. Yeah, likely. Likely. Uh, it's one thing after another here. Oh, great. Andy and now Dave. And the suit is still all bloody. It, oh, my arm hurts so bad. Uh, it's fine. William, calm down. One thing at a time. Let's start with getting the blood out of the suit. Oh my god, I can't believe William. Like, how can he accuse me of kidnapping a child like that? Oh, you, you know, you do all this work to try and become a better person, and then people just crap all over your past. You know what? I don't need William. I don't I don't need I don't need him. I don't need his stupid job. I don't need his stupid pizzeria. I'm I'm fine on my own. Hey, Dave! I heard you come in the door! Could you make me some dinner? I'm up here watching my shows right now, and you've just been gone all day! I don't know where you've been, so... If, if you could just make me some dinner, I'd appreciate it. Thanks, Dave! Um, Mother, I've, I've been at work all day. I'm sorry. Work? You have a job? I thought you'd be a deadbeat like your father! Oh well, well, just make me some dinner, okay? Excuse me? Did you just you talk about my said. dad? Yeah, he's a deadbeat, just like you. You know, your father always wanted me to kick you out, but since I'm such a good mother, I haven't done it yet. But I'm thinking about it, so make me some dinner. You know what, Agatha, you old bat? I am so sick of this. Oh, sick of what? Did you just call me Agatha? Listen here, Dave. Ooh, if Yo, I wasn't watching up. my show. you shut up. You shut up. I am sick of being treated like crap by you. I, I, You're I, I'm sick of being treated like crap by... You know what? You've got... You've got... Three days to get out of my house right now. You know, pack pack it all up. Get out. I I do everything for you, Dave. Every single uh, thing that I do for you. Shut up! I, I don't want to hear you talk anymore. I'm leaving. Oh my god! I can't believe her. Oh man, what am I gonna do? Should I? Okay, you know what? Pick up. Pick up. Hello? Uh, hey, Henry. Oh, Dave, how you been, buddy? Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest, not, uh, not the greatest. Uh, do you, do you still have any work for me? Oh, Dave, I thought you'd never ask, buddy. Yeah, why don't you come on down? You know what? I got a place you can stay, too. We've got a lot to talk about. Thanks, Henry. I, I really appreciate it. Yeah, anytime, Dave. You know I've always got your back. All right, I'll 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 come by tonight. All right, see you then, buddy. All right, bye. Ah, thanks, Doc. And I really appreciate it. I have all these... You know, new employees, potential employees coming in for interviews. So I can't be bleeding all over the place, you know? <laughs> oh, yes, yes, understandable, of course. You, you you, really do have quite a nice setup here. It's a beautiful, beautiful diner. Oh, uh, thanks. Thanks, I appreciate it. You know, those rabid dogs down the street really, uh... Really like my smell, I guess. <laughs> oh, yes, rabid dogs in Hurricane, of course, yes. Yeah, they're Those attacking. are totally real. Yeah, that just... must be what happened. Of course, they were just all over the place. So, just, they attacked me on my ride home. 
Crazy. Yes, well, you're all bandaged up now there, Sonny, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave this clipboard with you, okay? It has all my contact information. Feel free to contact me if you need anything at all. Great, okay. sounds good. It Thanks, also has Doc. all your patient information, so uh, if you decide to go with a different doctor next visit, he, he, he'll have your chart. Oh, you're don't worry, I would never. You're the only doctor for me. <laughs> yes, well, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and head out. Uh, you be careful uh, around here, okay? Oh, and for sure. dog bites, yes? Yeah, yeah, of course. Next uh, time you call me, it better be a real injury, you understand? Hey, how, why'd you put dog in quotes on here? Anyway, I better be going. Oh. It's starting to get late. Good luck with those interviews, oh. Sonny. All right. Well, I'll see you later, uh, Dr. Taggart. Thanks. Oh, no, don't. You don't have to use my last name. Just call me Phineas. Oh. I, I'm not one for titles. Oh, well, thanks, okay, Phineas. Well, oh, uh, have a fantastic day, William. Great. You as well. Ah, there we go. Fresh bandages. Let me go put this away before the new interviewees come in. Uh, I'll just throw this on the table. It's fine. Uh, all right, all right. How do I look? Anything in my teeth? All right, I'm good. Oh, uh, uh hello, welcome. <laughs> hey, dude. Welcome. Are you uh, are you the new interviewee? You here for a job? Oh uh, yeah, yeah. My dad said something about like a pizzeria position or something like that. So great. Well, good thing we're hiring. Uh, have you ever worked in uh fast food or restaurants before? Uh, no, I've actually never had a job before. Uh, I kind of just stay at home and listen to my, uh, my cassettes, you know? Oh, that's fine. That's understandable. Well, here, you'll be a little bit more hands-on. You'll have to... Hands-on? <gasps> oh, my God. You guys have snack machines, bro? Do I get these for free or something if I work here? Well, oh, my God, exactly. bro. Look at those. Dude, there's so much candy in there. Yes. Oh my god, you guys have soda machines too? Do I get free drinks every shift? That's well, what my friend I mean, gets at McDonald's. You can have maybe like one or two. I wouldn't go overboard though. Those are usually for the customers. The paying customers, oh. of course. Yeah. Wait, but, but I thought I would be paying with my time though. Well, no. Isn't that how working works? It, it's like a trade. Huh. You give me your time, I give you a paycheck. And <laughs> soda, right? And, and a cup of soda per shift. How about oh, wow, that? look at look at this thing. Could I hop in? Uh, is no, that Fred there? No. He's the guy on the sign, right? Is it a he suit? Is. Do you it, wear the suit? I do sometimes, but uh, not this one. I usually like to wear the spring bonnie suit. But spring. no, you Where's won't be suit? wearing the suits. You're you're not you're not trained we're, properly yet. Where's we're spring bonnie? Uh, he's in maintenance, getting fixed. He had a bit of a accident with that suit, so we gotta repair it before we oh. open it again. Accident, huh? Yeah. Well, what happened to your arm? Was that part of the accident, bro? No, I. Uh, it was a dog bite happened to okay. my arm. Radical, radical. Yeah, just, dog it, bites. Actually, that's kind of gnarly, dude. You have a scar. Uh, yeah. Under these bandages, it's pretty wicked, you know. Pretty cool. Whoa, wicked, cool. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, this uh, setup is pretty rad. I kind of, I kind of like mess with it, you know. Hey, so, great. Like, let's cover your job, what you're gonna be doing on your day-to-day -day basis. So you're going to come whoa, in, whoa, you're going to clock whoa, in, bro, bro, and then bro, you're going to... I'm going to have what? to stop you right there. Like, I'm not actually going to accept the job, but I might chill here for a little bit longer. What's in here? Wait, what do you mean? What do you mean you're uh, not going to accept the job? In. Yeah, this place is rad, bro. Wait, what did, what did you What did you say? What do you, oh, what do you mean? Uh, I'm actually just coming to this interview to get my dad off my back. My uncle told him about this place, and he was like, yeah, the guy who owns it's really nice. I guess he was talking about you or whatever. But my uncle was like, you should totally get your boy to, like, interview there. And I was like, yeah, sure, whatever, dad. Like, I just want to get back to listening to my cassettes. But, yeah. So I so, had to come here. He, like, dropped me off. But so he'll be back in, like, If I to, offered you the job, it. you wouldn't take it? No. So, you're not here looking for a job. Oh, well, like, I mean, like, I am, like, looking for a job, but, like, not this job, you know? Because you only give, like, one cup of soda <sighs> per shift. So, well, hey, let me go ahead and show you to the door. Right over this way. Follow Actually, me. Actually, I was thinking maybe I could, chat, like, look around just, a, like, a little bit more, because my dad's not going to be here, and it's really well, cold outside right now. That's, that's a darn shame. I have oh. plenty more interviewees to interview 
So you gotta uh, there's go. There's nobody home. out there when I was out there. So like, I don't what? think that's even true, bro. But like, whatever, Wait, man. What? Like, if that's your vibe, like, I'll go. Wait, I'll go down one out there. It's like a gas station. No, bro. It's like empty. Or at least it was when I got what? here. You... That's why I just kind of like walked right in because I'm the only one oh. here. Are you, are you sure you don't want a job? I mean, it's easy work. You just mopping the floor, picking up after children. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, I don't mind, like, mopping and stuff, but, like, I kind of hate kids, so, like... Oh, well, that's fine. You could just hide from them. You could wear a, a mask. No, I'm not gonna do that, but I am gonna go pick some stuff up at this gas station next door, so, like, what? catch you later, bro. Oh, what? Later. Whatever. See you later. Oh, no. Oh, no, there's really no one else out there. What am I gonna do? I, I can't run this place by myself. I could barely run it when Dave was here. Oh no, what am I gonna do? It's fine, maybe we can put an ad in the paper. Oh my kid, and I have no money for that. Uh, what the word of mouth. Maybe I'll just go to random stores and just start passing out flyers. Oh. That's Hello? A good idea. <gasps> Hello? Hello? Oh! Hello? Uh, hey, uh, am, am I late for my interview? <gasps> Absolutely not. Come take a seat right over here. Welcome. Okay, uh, amazing. Oh, hi, what's your name? Uh, my name is M. M? Like, uh, like the letter yeah. that's on your apron? Uh, um, no, it's, uh, it's, okay, this is a kind of embarrassing, but it's short for Emily. Emily, huh? Yeah. Yeah, my, really my mother like wanted a girl. Oh, well, you know what? That's understandable, M. I can see why you uh, chose the nickname now. Mm-hmm. Well, hey, this is the perfect... Wait a second. Aren't you already in a work uniform? Oh, yeah. Um, my my father worked at McDonald's, and so did my grandfather. You know, we're a long line of McDonald's men. Uh, uh, I'm, but I'm trying to branch out into a new industry. Well, are you sure you'll be able to work two jobs? That's an awful oh. lot. Oh, no. If I get this job, I'm quitting McDonald's. <gasps> That's great. Well, here, since you have plenty of experience, you already know how to mop and clean and make food, I'm assuming? Oh yeah, I work like 10 hours a day. They don't give me a break and they make me pee in a bottle. You work 10 hours a day and you don't need yeah. breaks? You're yeah, the perfect employee. Oh, I am? You are. Well, here. Uh, also, uh, one rule, not saying you have the job. I mean, we have countless uh, offers out there on the table, but hypothetically, uh, this back room, off, off, off limits. It can't go okay. back. Okay, it's the stage off limits too. I don't want to. I don't want to like break any boundaries here. No, you can come on stage. Uh, just okay. try not to touch the the suits. The suits well, are off limits, and so is that back room. But anywhere else okay. is free game. Well, would I be getting my own uniform? Uh, hmm. not right away. Maybe eventually. Oh. We gotta put okay. you through a I'll test phase. I'll just wear this then. Yeah, that's fine. Maybe we'll we'll change the M to a to a F for Fred Bears. Eh, okay, how's that yeah, sound? that sounds that sounds cool. Great. And hey, you won't take random breaks in the back and watch movies for hours, will you? Oh no, I never <gasps> take a break when I'm at work. <gasps> You're perfect. Well, I mean, I guess we could maybe try to start you off. Mm, let's see. When are you free next? Um, I could be free as soon as possible. I don't, I don't like working at McDonald's. <gasps> tomorrow morning? Are you gonna start tomorrow morning? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. Well, then I'll see you tomorrow morning. You come okay. in right and early. Um, what was your name again? Oh, call me William. William Afton. Okay, Will. Thank you for the job. I appreciate it. Of course. Thank you, M. You have a great rest of your night. Okay. You too. This is perfect. This is so great. I told Dave I don't need him. I don't need him. I don't need Andy. I can sort this all out of myself. Oh my gosh, I, I shouldn't be here. This is such a stab in the back to William. Uh, but you know what? He he wanted to fire me even though I quit. He's, he's a jerk. Uh, under construction. Ooh, this place is nice. Oh, I can't wait to see it finished. Um, interviews. Oh, okay, so the interview must be this way. Mm -hmm. oh, a lot of boxes. You'd think they'd be unpacked by now. Oh, red glass, that looks nice. 
Uh, oh, maybe, I think this looks like it. Uh, hello? Hello? Oh. oh Dave? Oh, My hey, Henry. Buddy, how you doing? Uh, I'm, here, let me I'm get doing alright. door for you. Close that behind you. You know, we don't actually have any other interview applicants, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know why I put a sign up. <laughs> well, it, it uh, helped me find the room, so... Oh, well, I'm glad. Well, let's just get down to business, shall we? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, uh, what do you what do you think you're looking for in this position? This is the assistant manager position. Are you sure this is something you want? Oh, you're assistant for manager. Somebody who's in it for the long haul. Oh, the other place I was working at, I I was just uh, I was just the cleaning boy. Oh, wow. Just the cleaning boy, huh? Yeah, and I got well, to not work on other stuff, but mostly I just did whatever the boss wanted me to do. The boss? Yeah. Well, hey, listen, man. Uh, here, you'll kind of be the boss. Once this place opens up, I won't have time to handle the day-to-day -day responsibilities, so that's what I'm bringing you on for. Technically, we do have somebody else in the position. Hmm. But he's kind of an idiot, so oh, okay. we're looking to move another direction with that. Oh, okay. Um, well, I, I could definitely handle the assistant manager position. That'd be no problem. But what would my job responsibilities be? Oh, well, you know, nothing nothing too serious. You know, you'd probably have to uh, deal with the occasional angry parent from time to time. Uh, you know, you'd want to keep an eye on the security cameras, make sure there's no lost items you'd be in charge of working the floor so you know if the dining room's open you'd have to walk around make sure everybody's still happy mm -hmm. you know how it is yeah yeah of course yeah so that's... you think you could handle that yeah that's that actually sounds amazing oh fantastic well we do actually have a fairly hefty signing bonus as well but we can negotiate that in just a moment i do have a few other questions mm -hmm. so it seems like you can handle the uh the responsibilities that are all above board, but there's some things we need to get done that won't quite be written out on paper, you feel? Uh, yeah, like under the table kind of stuff? Yeah, nothing illegal, don't worry, but uh, in this small town, we only have a few competitors. Oh, do you oh understand? Yeah. yeah, competitors. Uh, what do you want me to do, advertise or something? Uh, well, you know, we've got a budget for advertising, you don't have to worry about that. But the one thing that we don't have is those schematics yet. Uh, well, we got one of them. Listen, I don't know how he's doing that, but William, he's producing these animatronic suits like it's nobody's business. I mean, I've poured thousands, tens of thousands. Yeah, more money than you could possibly imagine, Dave, into research and development for these animatronic suits. And are I they, just can't get them as good. Are they Are they really that good? They really are. Uh, I heard tell. Did Did one of them really malfunction on him? Uh, I, I think that may have been the boss's fault. He may have not worked on it properly, or maybe it was my fault. I'm not really sure. Uh, uh, he, he, he tried to get inside of it. He really wasn't supposed to. Well, we can worry about this another time. Don't worry yourself right now, Dave. To be honest, I actually have some plans later today, and, well, if I'm being forthright with you, this is all just a formality anyway. You got the job, Dave. Come on, I know you, oh, man. Thank you so much, Henry. I, I really you appreciate it. This. I just had to, you know, check all the boxes to make sure things weren't, uh, you know, they mm. weren't going to be too much for you to handle. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Oh. Oh. <laughs> uh, everything all right in here? Oh, wow, of course, Andy. Andy, let me, uh, let me introduce you. I don't know if you two have met. This is my longtime uh, work compadre. His yeah. name's Dave, Dave Miller. Yeah, we, He's a good we've guy. met. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. Uh, how you I doing? remember you when I was leaving the uh, pizzeria the other day. You were on your way in. Oh, yeah, you're the, you're the guy with the yellow, yellow truck. Yeah, I mean, it's, yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah. Okay, yeah. well, you two, uh, you two just get acquainted. I actually have somewhere to be. Dave, uh, Dave starts soon. He's gonna be, um, well, let's just say he'll be filling in for you from time to time. Uh, 
I'll see y'all later, okay? Don't wander too much. There, It is still under construction in here, so don't hurt yourselves, okay? All right. I'll see y'all later. Good night, Henry. Yeah, you too, Dave. And and be safe, Andy, okay? Be safe. Uh, so, so I guess we're going to be working together, huh? <laughs> uh, uh, should, be, should be fun, right? Yeah, definitely. Uh... Hey, yeah. what would you say your name was? Da Davey? Davey? Uh, um, Dave. Dave. Mildred, right? Uh, Davey Mildred. Dave. Dave Miller. Oh. Oh, sorry. I'm not that. I'm not that great with names. Hey, listen, man. I'll get it soon. I'll get mm. it soon. Yeah. So, yeah. uh, anyway, <laughs> you said you're gonna be filling in for me. You're not. Wait. Are you also an assistant manager? Uh, I, it seems, seems like it. I was, uh, I was working for that other pizzeria, but, you know, I got, I quit, actually. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Good choice, man. That yeah. pizzeria sucks. I know the owner, William, he's mm -hmm. the worst. Yeah, well, you know, he's not that bad of a guy, you know, he's no, just... he's, he's pretty bad. I grew up with him, man. I think I would know. Wait. Dude, guess, get this. He used to pee his bed until he was nine years old. I mean, it was only <laughs> like two or three times, but uh. still... Uh, that's, that's a very, but you, you grew up with them? Oh, yeah, Will's my brother. I, I didn't mention that? Uh, no, you, this is the first time I'm hearing about it. I, I didn't know he had a brother. Yeah, well, he does. We don't talk too much. <laughs> I tried to, uh, quote unquote, rekindle our relationship recently, but I was actually just getting close to him so I could steal those schematics for Henry. Wait, the... The anim animatronic schematics. Yeah, yeah. That, I, uh, that Fredbear one I still couldn't get. But I did manage to get that Spring Bonnie rabbit thing, whatever he calls it. I, you know I got in a lot of trouble for that, because he thought I lost it. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> hey, well, don't worry about that. I mean, now you got a whole new job lined up, so yeah, uh, don't worry yeah, about it. I, I guess I it's not a big deal. doesn't give you benefits. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's that's true. This This place seems like it'll be a lot better for me. Uh, yeah. Oh, what are you gonna do with your signing bonus, man? That's how I got that sweet car outside. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna have to use that for a new apartment. Actually, <laughs> I had some issues with my uh, uh my landlord. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's uh, fair. Yeah. I'm actually. Hey, don't tell anybody, but I'm actually living in the back of the car right now. Cause uh. Oh. Oh, that's unfortunate, man. Oh. Uh, well. You yeah. Know, it's, you know, it's maybe fine. you'll work your way out of it. It's no worries, man. Yeah, we exactly. All struggle time I mean, this to time. is such a good opportunity for me. I mean, it's the first time I've had a good job in a while, so mm -hmm. I'm really enjoying it. Hey, uh, just a heads up: there is a checklist um, uh, that w or he, he puts it up every few days. Um, I actually don't know what he's trying to find a replacement for, um, but it looks mm -hmm. like he's also in the market for a new car, so that's pretty cool. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. Um, well, um, I don't, I don't really know how I'm supposed to help with those things, but. Uh, oh, we don't have to help now. Uh, when did he say your first date was, or did he tell you yet? I, I don't know. I think he's just going to give me a call. Oh, cool, cool. Well, uh, in that case, uh, feel free to familiarize yourself with the facilities, but don't wander off too much without a hard hat. Like I said, there's mm. still uh, some construction. All anyway, right. well, uh, I got to go. Yeah, I don't I gotta, really have an excuse. I just, I'm so bored of talking to you, so oh. bye, Dave. I'm just going to leave. All right, well, later, jerk. No. Hey! Oh no! I, I can't clean. I can't clean up the pizza sauce. It's it's so hardened. M, is that the same stain I asked you to clean up hours ago? Yeah, I need a scrubber. This is this is not gonna come out very easily. Em, you have a whole to-do list. This oh. was the first thing on your list. This is supposed to take a couple minutes. Oh, it's it's gonna take a while, man. I don't know what. To, uh, I need a scrubber or something, or maybe a, a, a knife scrubber. to scrape it off. It's so hardened. Em, you're in the kitchen. There's knives and scrapers all around you. Oh, oh yeah, <laughs> there is, isn't there? <laughs> em, this is no laughing matter. But we have uh, so many things. There's the oh, gum so and the sorry. trash. And did you even start the dishes yet? Oh, I was gonna do that after finishing this. Ah, uh, M. Come on, I have so much to do. This was your only job. Uh, well, don't jobs. Don't worry, boss. I, I got it. Don't you worry. I'll get right on it. I'll find a scrubber and I'll make sure this this state is gone forever. 
Uh, you know, just just go do one of the other things. I'll I'll handle the stain, okay? Okay. Gotcha, boss. <sighs> All right, it's fine. It's fine, William. Everything's gonna be fine. It's just it's just a stain. It's just a little stain. That's all. Here, I bet I could scrub this out real quick. Oh. Boss. Um, hey, boss. What? Oh no. Can I put yes. on one of these suits? These look really cool. Wait. What? M. No. No. Why Don't is touch this those suits. Covered in blood. M. Get out of there. Oh. M. <sighs> oh, they look really Wait. cool. I told you not to go back there. That was your first rule when you got hired. Was it? I thought it was to do my job and not to take bathroom breaks. Well, I thought that was implied with any job, oh, kind of. Oh, okay. Well, my bad. It's fine. Do you mind taking out the trash, at least? Uh, yeah, I got you, boss. Thanks. Oh, this is a disaster. What am I going to do with him? He can't even do the most basic job. You know what? Maybe I do need Dave back. No, what am I saying? I, I don't need Dave. I don't need him. You know, I could run this place by myself if I had to. Maybe I do need to train M a little bit more, though. Hey, but uh, rate, boss, does it matter uh, which dumpster I put it in? What? There's no, two just... dumpsters, and I, did, I didn't want to put it in the wrong one. Is, is one of them full? Uh, no, they're both pretty empty. Then just throw them in whichever one you feel like. Okay. Great, thanks, Em. <sighs> I don't know how much longer I can do this. Ah, that dinner was really good. Where's Clara at? You... Oh, hey. I didn't know you were out here. Hi, hon. Ugh. <sighs> Diner's not going well. Oh? No, it's between Dave and then... Now M doesn't even know how to do anything. He was cleaning a stain for hours the other day. I just... I don't know what I'm doing. Maybe... Maybe I made a mistake. Don't... Don't... Don't let yourself get down. I mean... It's just so hard to, though. It's just... It's all going wrong. One thing after another. Constantly, you know? But you're a brilliant inventor. Have, have you had the chance to work on your more an automated stuff lately? Not really. I mean, I still have the blueprints down at the diner, but it's just... There's, what's even the point? I'll never be able to finance them. Especially with the way the diner is going. We barely have had any customers since opening. What's, what's the point? Hmm. Well, you know, there is one thing you could do. Oh yeah, what's that? I mean, you're like I said, your 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 creations are absolutely amazing. Why not try and well, I don't know, get them ready and sell them and try and make some money? Sell them? I I couldn't sell them. These are state-of-the-art designs. These will revolutionize animatronics as we know them. Ex I can't just exactly. give them to someone else. But they're worth a lot of money, and if... I... Yeah, but I, I can't just... Uh, well, I mean... Hmm. You don't have I to really sell them one. the exact ones you work on and patent, but maybe hmm. a little bit less brilliant ones could make money too oh. oh clara you're a genius you're a genius maybe <laughs> maybe this is what we needed maybe this could work this i have an idea i i gotta run back to the diner i gotta i gotta get him I'll, I'll i'll see you later dinner was delicious by the way Th thank you i'll be back later I can't believe I didn't think of that. Claire is a genius. This will work out great. I'll, I could sell that plan and we could sell it to all kinds of different restaurants around the world and we can finally make some money. We don't have to scrape by for ends meet. Uh, where did I leave those blueprints? There's so many papers around here. They could be anywhere. Uh, in here, no, no, wait, where are they? Where are my blueprints? 
They're... They're all gone! But... They, they gotta be in here somewhere, I just... I... I know I had them in here! I had... I had them right in this file cabinet, I thought! I... They're all gone! They're all gone! Oh no, no, William, calm down! You just misplaced them! That's all, they're just... You, just, you had to have... There's, there's a bunch of file cabinets, maybe... You're stressed, you're stressed, that's all it is! Come on, uh, let's, let's get our mind in the game! Let's, let's focus! All right, we need to come up with new suits. Ooh, new suit designs. We gotta keep the bear and bunny, of course. Everyone loves Fred Bear and Spring Bonnie, but what other animals? Maybe like a, like a hippo? Like a, oh, like a bird? Some kind of chicken? Maybe like a fox even, or, or a wolf? There's so many ideas, this is gonna be great. As soon as I find these blueprints. Come on, where'd I put them? Hmm, that's it. Uh, over here? No, maybe, maybe I left them out in a different room. Uh, oh yeah, the back room, of course. Obviously, that's... No, they want to be back there. What is going on? Uh, I don't even know where to start looking now. Maybe... Oh! No. Wait. Wait a second. Wait a second, it was... Must have been Dave. William. Huh? William. No You're kidding. Oh, hey man, look, I I need to tell you something. Oh, I know what you need to tell me already. I just figured it out. Are you happy, what? Dave? Are you happy it took me this long? Um, I don't I don't know what you're talking about. I oh, you need you need to hear this. You don't know what I'm talking about. Oh, you don't. What about all my missing blueprints, Dave? Huh? Yeah, that's what I need to talk to you about. Oh, that's... Look, I know that's what you need to talk about. Where are they? Give me them. Okay, look, look, look. You're, you're, there's no easy way to tell you this, man. You stole but, them. I know you did. You're the what? only one who no, was back there. No, I didn't steal them. I, I can't believe You just believe let me it. finish. You thief. You steal what? from me, and then you come back? You have the audacity to come back here? No. You know what? William, come on, man. You're being a jerk. No, you're... The thief calling me a jerk? That's it. Get out. Not a thief. Get out. Get out. Are Get you out of serious, my diner. William? Go. Are you serious? Go back wherever you came from. Go home. Do whatever you gotta do. Never come back here again. I can't believe you. you I gave what? you Fine. so many I, chances. I don't even want to be here. Good. You know what? I was trying to help you. Help me? Help me by stealing my life's work? I'm doomed now. I'm. Oh, not him too. Oh, hey, oh. what's going on? I should have known you'd be here, Dave. What? You jerk. What What did I do? Why is everybody mad at me? I'm out of a job because of you. Wait, huh. you oh, got fired? Oh, really? oh you, you'd love to hear this, probably. Guess what? This joker right here, you know, the one who used to work for you, guess where he's working now? Where? Foxy's Family Pizzeria. Isn't that oh. right, Dave? Oh, so well, you're yeah, co-workers like, then. You're yeah, both I working quit. together? Hmm. Not anymore. Actually, I've just been fired. <laughs> I'm out of a job again. Uh, that, <laughs> just like you said would happen. That's a little ironic, isn't it? Look what we Shut have up. here. The two traitors right in front of me. Real but, nice. No, no, no. William, that, there's something I need to tell you. You've it, already said enough. Him. You've said hey. plenty, Dave. Yeah, I agree. I think you have said plenty, Dave. You know, whatever. You guys deserve each other. Have fun being a weird, dysfunctional family. Yeah, whatever, You're Dave. Get out of here! Mm. <sighs> Can't believe that guy. Yeah, so... Hey, uh... I, I feel kind of bad about everything I said to you earlier on. Hmm. So... Are you sure you're not saying that because you just got fired? Kind of, maybe a little bit, too. Oh. <laughs> well, uh, but I gotta pay for this car somehow, so if you're looking for work, hmm. could you throw me a bone, man? <sighs> I'll do anything. I'll scrub toilets with my bare hands. Please, Will. Well, the worker I have now is really bad, but how do I know I can trust you? You, how do I know you won't just quit once you get your first check? I promise, this time, I'm on the up and up. 
we can do this together. I, I know how much work you put into Fredbear's family diner. I, I promise, I I'll make things easier for you. Well, it would be nice to have the Afton brothers running this place instead of some random kid. All right, you know yeah, what? and uh, we don't even have to be running it together. I'll be a normal employee, mm. you know? I I'll, I'll scrub tables, I I'll, I'll do dishes, anything. <sighs> fine, fine. You can work here. Oh. I'll allow it. But, Andy, one <sighs> mistake, one goof up. If I even sense that you're trying to wrong me in any way, you're out. You're out of yeah. here so fast. Totally. One strike, I'm out. I get it. Great. Well, well, I guess I have to make a call to M. Hey, uh, before you go back inside, mm. um, this is kind of a weird question, but do you mind if I park in your parking lot overnight? Uh, sure, I guess, but how are you going to get home? Um, I'll figure it out. Don't, don't worry about it. Oh. Thanks. Uh, okay. Good luck with calling M. Yeah, good luck with is. your... Parking, I, I guess. I don't know. Weirdo. Jeez. Oh boy, this is gonna be an awkward call. But I am excited to fire him. Hello. Hey Dave, how's the new apartment? It's perfect. Th thanks for co-signing. I don't think I could have gotten it otherwise. No need to thank me. It was my pleasure, Dave. Take some time to get settled in, and if you could stop by in a bit to discuss a few things, that'd be great. Sure thing, Henry. Alright, I'll let you go now. See you later, Henry. So this screw goes here, and this goes over there? Hey, you got it! You're a natural, Andy! Thanks, Billy. Er, I mean, William. Hey, I'm really glad we can do this sort of thing together. Me too. I'm really sorry about all the fighting we've been doing lately. I'm happy we could get along. Me too, man. Thank you for giving me a chance. I know I've been a total jerk lately, and I'm sorry. Hey, you don't need to apologize. No, I do. The truth is... Well, I've always been really jealous of your talent and your ambition. Really? Yeah, Mom and Dad always would tell me I needed to be more like you, and... I don't know. I guess I always resented you for it a little. It's not your fault, man. They didn't treat us equally, and it wasn't fair to you. I bet you're just as talented. You just need to find your thing. Well, working on these animatronics has been the highlight of my year. Well, like I said, you're a natural. Maybe one day you could co-own this place with me. Wait, seriously? Of course! This pizzeria is just phase one of my plans. I have this idea of a company. I'm gonna call it Williams Animatronics. Well, maybe one day I can be as good at making these things as you are. Maybe we could even call it Afton Robotics? I'd like that. Hey, William. There's something I need to tell you. What is it? I don't want you to be mad at me. 
Look, whatever it is, we can get past it. You'll always be my little brother. It's about Dave. What about Dave? He didn't hey, steal. Hey, boss. I'm ready for work. Hey, didn't you fire that guy? Yeah, I did. Hey, M, you remember our phone call, right? Yeah, you said I was on fire. That means I did a good job, right? No, M, I said you were fired, not on fire. I don't understand the difference. Fired means you don't work here anymore. Wait, what? I thought I did a good job. No, you did a terrible job. Oh. Maybe you can get your McDonald's job back? I already threw my urine bottle out. What am I supposed to pee in? Oh, can't you just buy another bottle? I suppose. I'll just get out of your hair. Good luck, Em. What a weird kid. He's alright. Not the brightest, though. That's for sure. Hey, what were you talking about? What did it Dave steal? Um, Dave didn't steal my job. What do you mean? I, um, I quit because I wanted to work for you. And you needed to tell me that? <laughs> yeah, it's stupid. Don't worry about it, man. Let's get ready to open. Hey, Dave. Hey, Henry. What's the game plan for today? I'm glad you asked. I wanted to show you something. Come with me. Whoa. It's beautiful, ain't it? Unfortunately, can only make it dance to music. That's amazing. Yeah, but it's not enough. I've got a man who can help make it alive, per se. What do you mean, alive? You know, more interactive. That'd be awesome. Indeed it would, but that William might just beat us to the punch. Which is why I need a, a small favor from you. Yeah? I need you to sneak into that diner and sabotage the animatronics. Henry, I told you no more shady business. I know I have no right to ask this of you, but we need more time to get Foxy's ahead of the game. If you help with this, the business will take over the industry, and I'll make sure you're set for life. How much are we talking? Okay, Andy, you ready for your first day opening? Let's do it. Okay, make sure the animatronics are powered on. Hey, Billy. I don't know if these things are ready. What do you mean? We worked on them all day yesterday. It looks like we didn't do anything, though. This can't be right. We open in 20 minutes! We don't have time to fix them! Well, we don't have time to fix both of them. What do you mean? 
We could probably fix one of them in time, but not both. We need both. I know, but what if we just fixed Spring Bonnie and I'll wear the Fredbear suit? Andy, that's way too dangerous! Look at my arm! I know. No, you don't. You need to understand that I got off easy. Those spring locks could have killed me. Well, we can't just disappoint the kids. We can figure something else out. It'll be fine. I'll be very careful. Andy. It's okay. I'll be fine. The kids will love it, and you, me, and Clara will get dinner tonight. Now let's fix Spring Bonnie and get your customer service face on. Okay, but if you start sweating, make sure you take it off. Let's get to work. Have a good night! Tonight went well. You're a really good Fred Bear, Andy. Who's Andy? I'm Fred Bear. Very funny. Now get out of the suit. We gotta celebrate. <laughs> okay. Um, I can't get this suit off. Uh, the zipper's stuck. Wait, are you serious? It's not a big deal. I'll just cut it off and repair it later. Hurry up! Don't panic, it'll just make it worse. Wait here, I have a saw in the back. A saw? It's all that I have that'll work. The suit is really tough. Fine, just, just go get it. My condolences. Thanks, Phineas. You didn't need to come. It wasn't an inconvenience. I'm always a phone call away. Why didn't you just listen to me, Andy? I told you it wasn't safe. Hello, Mr. Afton. What are you doing here? Just offering my condolences. You stole my ad slot and fired Andy? He'd still be alive if not for you. It was all business, William. Certainly I never intended for anything like this. I'd like a chance to make things right. What's the point? Andy's gone and Fred Bears is gonna close down. I know things look tough right now, and you'll need time to process your grief. But once you feel up to it, I'd like you to give me a call. How much time do we have? Not much, but enough. He's still fresh, 
and perfect for this. This couldn't have played out better. We have a test subject, and I might actually be able to buy my competitor. I can't say I agree with your methods. I'm not paying you to agree with me. Now dig. Ha <laughs> ha.